January 22, 2021. Unlike with the previous weekend, I decided to sleep in Olango Island so that it will be more easier and nearer to my favorite fishing spot in Tanganan Island. I left my office early at 3 o'clock in the afternoon and go home, prepare all the fishing gears, some clothes, foods, and of course the beer, and go directly to Makta Newtown where I drop my Sido fish from. Me and my son Raven reached Olango around 5 o'clock in the afternoon. We decided to go sunset fishing until 7 o'clock but unfortunately got no fish on so we left the fishing spot and went to a camping site in San Vicente, Olango Island where we can sleep for the night. We had our dinner and a glass of beer before taking a sleep. We rented a 300 peso tent with an entrance fee of 100 peso per person for us to enter the camping site and have a sleep in preparation for the next day early dawn fishing adventure. We were able to sleep for 4 hours and wake up around 2.45 in the morning and we go directly to the fishing spot. We successfully arrived around 4 o'clock in the area and do vertical jigging immediately. Transferring from one spot to another, changing jigs from time to time, hoping that it will catch the hungry gophers, the red snappers, and even tunas below. By the way, thanks and shout out to Dr. Cliff Joy Golanag, my town mate in South Cebu, specifically the town of Oslo, for sharing me more fishing spots in this area. We have tried transferring three jigging spots, but unfortunately, got no fish on. My son Raven is already hungry and so myself. After 4 hours of jigging so we plan to stop and find our breakfast at the Fish Sanctuary restaurant in San Vicente.
suddenly, after planning to make the last drop, we get a signal below of a good fish on. It's a significant size as the fish falls down the line. I spool in the line meter by meter, carefully taking care of how the fish pulls itself, making sure it won't escape. Me and my son are all excited to see what species did we caught, still hoping it won't be a shark anymore. After 15 minutes of fighting the fish up into our jet ski, we finally landed a significant size of a black scabbard fish, weighing 5 kilograms with a length of 128 cm. The black scabbard fish is a bathypelagic cutlass fish of the family Trichuridae. Its length is up to 110 cm but it reaches maturity around 80 to 85 cm. Its scientific name is Apanopus carbo under the phylum Chordata. Okay. After successfully landing the 5 kg fish, we decided to go home because we don't have ice to preserve the fish for a longer period of time. The sea is very calm today, so getting to the shore at the Makta Newton takes only a few minutes with our zero fish pro.
We enjoy the jet ski ride going to the shore and after 30 minutes we reach Mactan Newton Beach and go home directly. We take our very very late breakfast, slaughter the fish, Clean all the fishing gears and take a rest. The weekend fishing experience was very memorable. We had a very good father sand bending in the deep water. We had a night camping. We catch a fish. We enjoy the jet ski ride. And that completes my week. Able to refresh and very deep for the upcoming week's challenges. <laughs>